Good morning, day 75, and I'm here in Chester, hanging out on uh, Michael and Annika's porch where we stayed last night, and just uh, going to eat a little bit of food, get some coffee, well I'm not going to drink the coffee, and uh, get going on the trail. <laughs> Back on the trail outside of Chester at Highway 36, uh, 1332.5, headed northbound with Spring and Custodian and Baloo. Did you see the mouth of Pussy Teeth on? <laughs> <laughs> kind of looks like a plastic bat. <laughs> <laughs> it's a nice cloudy, foggy, cool day to be walking through a burned forest. And it's quiet. So the burn area is from the Dixie Fire a couple years ago. Longest or biggest fire in California's history, I think. Um, so I thought I was going to be walking through a burn area for a lot longer, but only a couple of miles, maybe five miles, and now I'm in some nice green. Hopefully it'll last a while. It's raining! I think this is probably the first real rain I've gotten the whole trail. Big fat drops of rain. I'm only a little wet. Gotta put you away, camera. The rain has turned to hail. And some pretty crazy thunder right above my head. It's <sighs> a good size. I'm in an uneven, kind of uneven stand of trees. So I feel like I'm in the best place for uh, avoiding a light. Keep walking, but I'm not going to come out of the tree. I'll stop if the tree stops. Another great day. Good night. <laughs> Good morning. It's day 76. And today I'm going to be walking through Lassen Volcanic National Park, which is exciting because I've never been in this park before. Um, lots of burn trees so far. Loudest woodpecker. Took a little side trip to Boiling Lake. Look at the pattern on this dead tree. That's so cool looking. Feels just like the rest of the wood. Log crossing.
walking in the snow. More snow. Earlier there was a, a lot more snow cover. So a little more challenging and uh, technical, more of a puzzle to find the route. But here there's snow patches and then in between melted pieces of trail so you can easily see where the trail goes. Can you see that little spot up ahead? Right there. Trail. Trail. It's been a uh, pretty easy to route finding with uh, the snow being so shallow because I could just look for logs that are cut like this. Evidence of the trail crews coming through and clearing the down logs. Thank you, trail crews. So I've decided to take another side trail, alternate trail, the Cluster Lakes Trail. Um, it's about the same distance, five miles, um, as taking the PCT, and then it reconnects right back to the PCT. I decided to take the side trail because it goes by a couple lakes. And I figured I might as well do a little bit of a tour of Lassen Volcanic National Park while I'm here. And also, a lot of other people have flipped over the Sierra and come here. So I'm back in the bubble, meaning I'm back in kind of the, the main crowd of the PCT through hikers. So the side trail should also give me a little bit more of a solitary wilderness experience, which I like. Feather Lake. Silver Lake. One of the cluster lakes. Found another cool tree pattern. Lines look like they're in 3D. And the other of the cluster lakes. The lines all over, made by trees falling and burning. Really neat. Like evidence of the death of that tree. today's theme is death, but not in a bad way, like a death and rebirth. Like this tree here that fell over recently enough where all the needles are still green.